They're all driving. Oh yeah. <laughs> the traffic. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, this reminds me of a Portuguese city uh, mm. up in the mountains. Right. What was the name of that city? But yeah, just out of Lisbon. Sintra. 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 Yeah. Sintra. Yeah. Yes, yes. Yeah, and Santa Teresa, where we go later, is also very like that. It was actually the Portuguese, they mimetized their cities here. Wow. So right now we're in the parking lot and we're getting ready to go up to Corcovada which is a mountain that houses the Re Christ the Redeemer, the very famous statue that you see when you come into Rio. And um, we're going to be taking a tram that lasts about 20 minutes. So we have to park down here and then we're going to be taking the tram to go up there. So we're really excited. excited. Yeah. Day two in Brazil. Day two. Hey! <laughs> nice. Well, go ahead. Well, you want to? Um, um, so, yeah. We're walking to the train station so we can go up. Christ the Redeemer. Yeah, there he is. I'm excited because I've always had a dream about seeing this huge statue of Jesus Christ. And I guess this is a dream come true now. Yeah. We are at the strange station going up, right? Yeah, we are in the tram station and he's getting the tickets for us to go up. I was told it takes about 20 minutes to get up there and we will be showing you pictures of the ascent. So excited. So it took 10 years to build the Redeemer Christ thing and it was built by um, uh, a royal family member called the Princess Isabella who was very religious and she it was the one that got rid of slavery and when they wanted to construct a statue up in that area they said that they should construct a statue of Isabella but Isabella said no we should construct a, uh, a statue of the true Savior which is Jesus Christ so that's how they got the Redeemer up there yay Look at that! Oh, the Christ! Oh, the Christ! Okay. Be careful. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, this is it. Oh my god. It's very cute. Is it go straight up? Yeah. I'm scared. Oh. 
Hey, 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 so we're going up right now. So yeah. We're going up now. Going up. It's amazing how it's able to fight gravity <laughs> to go up. Yeah. Wow. You got to have to walk up this thing, it'd be very hard. Oh, oh yeah, some people do that. Oh my god. So how, how long is the train ride up there? 20 minutes, 20 minutes only, yeah. And we're gonna be going through the Chushuka Forest, which is the biggest urban forest in the world. Oh really? And all of a sudden we get to Sugar Forest? Sugar Forest? Is that what you said, Sugar? No. Sugar Lake? Tijuca. 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 It's a native word. Oh, Many uh, places, especially in Sao Paulo, but also in Rio, take names from the natives. Oh, yeah, exactly. that's like, why. Like in a lot of Spanish countries. Yeah. So this train has only one track, so according to Marcelo, they have to synchronize all the timing of going up and down a train, right? Exactly. No. So it's a, like a 20 minute ride, but you get to see like a great view, you know, from, from here to city. I don't want to go too far. Look at these clouds. Clouds. Oh, clouds. Yeah. I can't see anything anymore. <laughs> All right, we're here. Wow. It's amazing. Feels good. It well, does. It, good, it does. Indeed. Very fresh. Are these people waiting to go back? Mm -hmm. This feels like an exclusive people. Ah. Yeah. Hope they are all gone by the time we we'll get down. Yes, that would be great. Okay. Are we actually on that side? Cool. Are we okay? Yeah, we're gonna get on this side. Alright. Oh, Alright, we're going to the Oh, wow. Excuse me. What? We're here, wow. Wow. It's a little cloudy, yes, but still. Man. And I mean, we can be here as long as you need. Mm. Wow. We All have right. to get that. I'm going to take a photo too. What do you think, Adam? Oh, love it. Yeah. Just gonna take a photo of that. It's like a dream come true for me. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. And then actually amazing. with the clouds around it, it's kind of more magical, magical more exactly. mystical, and magical. Oh, yes. Actually, when I went to Dubai, I wanted to see Burj Khalifa, Burj Khalifa under yeah. the clouds. Really? But I, it, uh, that was not calm. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Wow, I can't believe it. Marconi so designed a here. platinum card for uh, Emirates. Emirates. Yeah. Yeah. The airlines. Mm -hmm. They're platinum cards with the Burj. Burj. So he won the first place for that. Really? Yeah. That's nice. Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. Excuse yeah. us. Welcome to the Flashback. Oh, Adam, look at this. 
Yeah, this is just amazing. So we are right now, we finally reached the pinnacle. And this is a kind of an Art Deco version of Christ the Redeemer. So it's Art Deco style, but it's just so beautiful and so impressive. Yeah. Thank you, Marcelo. Here's our lovely guy. Hey, thank you. You better book him. He's amazing. Yeah. Thanks, Mark. Wow. Taking all different types of pictures, as you can imagine. Even this guy who's on his back taking pictures looking upward. Well, it's been blocked now. So it's very Art Deco. Marshall is saying that everything is very symmetric, geometric, and awesome. Wow. And then the view, my God, of Rio. That is just amazing. Yeah, <laughs> Oh, it cleans the other side. Oh, wow. That's the most important view. Oh, my God. Wow. That's Cocabana over there. Mm -hmm. The lake. That's the lake. You're right. And you live by the lake. Yes. Right here. Uh huh. And that's the, you see the canal divides right. Ipanema from Leblon. Oh, and then that fort that our landlord was saying, is it worth going? The, the fort in between For Copacabana. For breakfast. Oh, really? Yeah, Copacabana fort. Do you have a very delicate mosaic of, of soapstone, mm -hmm. little triangles. Oh, wow. So it's a mosaic. If, if there's a storm, it won't be blown away, will it? No, but the lightning from a, a big rain broke the finger. Oh, really? And you have little things to to get the lightning. How do you mm -hmm. call that? Yes. The uh, terror. Yeah. Yeah, it's uh, like a lightning rod. Lightning rod. Yeah, the lightning rod. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Lightning. It acts as li like a lightning rod. Yeah. But even though it broke the finger once, Wow. And then in, it, it was like this in the end. I'm kidding. <laughs> Wouldn't that be something? Yeah, right? <laughs> it's beautiful. This oh is an amazing yeah. view. I mean, you don't get this. I don't like heights. It, you don't? It does something to my private parts that I don't like. <laughs> but it's a dream come true for me. When I was a kid, I was like having dreams of seeing this. And I said, maybe it's in the Philippines because I, I I, don't know if I no idea if I would travel the world, right? But every time I would see a huge statue of Jesus Christ and look where I am now. So it's really <laughs> memorable. This is something like I've always I mean I'm talking about 40 years you know wanting to see this yeah and stopping yourself because of well it's just these that, people saying oh don't no, go it's, no it's just yeah, that right? I never had a chance many to go people down. I just like because we, we had other priorities I was working and doing this and now we just said oh fuck it I want to see South America there's so much to see because it's one area I haven't really explored been to Europe been to Mexico been to Central America been to North America Asia we know Africa Africa, I've been to Africa. I want to explore more of, but Africa and South America, there's so much yeah. more. And the food is better here, too. It really is. Beautiful. And Brazilian food has... someone on the internet they've been to every country in the world every country in the world yeah so that's just like wow some countries are really hard to travel to they are like india and, and egypt well yeah and well places in africa which i mean first of all getting there is almost impossible yeah. burundi i mean uh, some really small countries but they went to every single country
you, you were saying earlier too that these are all made in like from a mosaic stone yeah it's yeah. a very delicate mosaic of little triangles of soapstone wow that's amazing and then and we locked out today that it's not as busy yes right it's a very good day not as busy at all you can only just stay as the last, you know. For, for me and Adam, when we travel, yeah. take photos, videos, and then, okay, we're good. Yeah. <laughs> let's eat, let's drink. <laughs> but you still have a but little. I love this. There. Oh, okay. Yeah. Then let's do this. The, the oh, you see there? Yeah. Also, that's the oh, sugar low. And like, and then you end up there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. wow. So this was built when again? From 1931 for 10 years. So 1932 to celebrate oh, wow. 100 years of independence. And it became the iconic structure yes. of Brazil, right? For real. It's amazing. Yeah. I think it's the most iconic image of South America. Right? It, no, definitely it is. It's the most popular. And it's actually one of the icon top iconic places in the world. In the world. In the world. Yeah. yeah. And that's the sugar low. Yes, please. Wow. Can you take a photo from your camera? Can you see it now? <laughs> Oh, it's nice. It's cool up here. Oh, wow. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, my goodness. It's beautiful. Oh, look at the monkey. Oh, oh, oh my God, the monkey. Yeah. <laughs> So cute. Wow. It's like a baby. Oh, I oh my guess God, we yeah. are done. Like we've seen er almost everything. Monster. And I will never forget this moment. Let's see the other but side. It's just beautiful. Look at that. Let's look at this. Look at that. Then there's Ipanema over there. And then there's Copacabana on the inside. And that's a lake. Can you believe that? There's a lake here next to the ocean. Wonderful. Now we're, we are going to see the other side of this wonderful structure. Look. Okay, 
so there's a chapel. It's amazing. Oh. And this is the Apatis uh, Desen, which is the the painter of the uh, It's absolutely beautiful. Um, so has it always been here, the chapel? Yes, yes. Oh, okay. And uh, that is an example of the the sands that I said that the uh -huh. Catholic Church oh, okay. syn syncretism uh -huh. and it's just it's not canonized but they say she is like a oh, version no. of what the, what's the name of the saint? Parisita Parisita so I braved it I actually Bring up this. Oh yeah, this? my camera will do better. It. All right. Yeah. Yes. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah, that's it. The souvenirs. This is nice. I love. <laughs> Very. So in Brazil, Sao Paulo has more. That's the end of our wonderful, wonderful tour of Christ the Redeemer. You should all come and see it. It's so iconic, so amazing. What a dream come true. Yes, we loved it. Oh, we're boarding the train now. Going down. Right there. Right here. Right here? Yeah. It's this side? Mm -hmm. Okay. Very amazing. Very VIP access. <laughs> VIP access, exactly. Yes. This makes a lot of sense. So we'll have to plan our trip to Rio after May of next year. Yeah, please. And now that it's also good time. That is gorgeous. Cool, cool, this is a jockey club. Ooh, we are heading down now, and then this is such a wonderful view. Awesome. And, uh, how do you draw? Oh, okay. Okay. 
Hello, Daddy. This guy over here. Where is he? Oh, look at that statue. That's a basketball player. I know. I know. But I mean, we have some ball, right? Having another city with the same name would be boring. So, there is much more. Rio de Janeiro. In Rio de Janeiro, it translates to a river of Janeiro. A Janeiro. It's hidden for tomorrow. It's because from Sugarloaf. Oh, we're gonna do that. Okay. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Okay. All right. But yes, it's a river because it's the bay. They thought it was a river. And it was crazy. Oh, oh, yeah. That's it for us. Yes. But that was that was amazing. Amazing. Thank you. That was beautiful. Thank you. Such a great experience. Oh, yes. I like this store. Lugano, Lugano. Gramado. Is that, chocolate. Is that a popular? Brazilian chocolate. Is Brazilian popular? chocolate? Yeah. From so, oh, really? Yeah. Is it good? German areas. So, is it cheaper here to buy that one or we have uh, to go somewhere else? Lugano only here. Oh, really? Okay. There's another chocolate brand called Dangle that mm -hmm. we're going to see tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's the, the brand from Rio. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, okay. So, should we try? Should we check out Lugano? Take a look. Let's yeah. just take a look. Why not? You know, in the south, they have a city. That is like a German city. Look at this. That's Lugano. No, oh. uh, it's Gramado in the south of Brazil. Oh. Just like a German. That's in Brazil? Yeah, yeah. South. They have a place. Like